As they stepped into the cave, the air grew heavy. The crystals on the walls, usually bright and vibrant, were as dim as dying embers. It's the Guardian! He looks so weak! He's not sick. He's out of power. Look at the walls. The Dracodex says the crystals form a giant magical network. Think of it like a circuit on a computer chip. Each crystal acts as a conductor, passing energy along the line. The energy needs a complete, unbroken path to travel. But look, the circuit is broken. The flow of energy is blocked. We need to repair the circuit. If we can replace the broken crystals and complete the web, the energy can flow again and recharge the Guardian. A worthy plan. I will clear the heavy rocks. I'm small and fast. I can search for fallen crystal shards in the small crevices. Great. I'll use the diagram in the Dracodex to map the circuit and figure out exactly where each piece goes. Ember, I need a triangular shard for the upper conduit. Zephira, can you move that large boulder? The main power line runs right underneath it. That's the last one, but I can't reach it. But we can. Climb on, young engineer. Lifted high on Zephira's powerful back, Neo reached up and set the final crystal into the wall. For one silent, breathless moment, nothing happened. Then, a single pulse of light shot through the web. It raced like lightning, awakening every crystal it touched until the entire cave roared to life with brilliant, beautiful light. It is a gift. The Guardian is thanking you. That night, Neo learned a lesson not found in any book. He wrote, Even the strongest guardian sometimes needs help, and a good team is the most powerful circuit of all. It wasn't easy. Each crystal had to fit perfectly. It was a puzzle that required Zephyra's strength, Ember's speed, and Neo's brilliant mind. None of them could have done it alone. And I found the missing piece. And Zafira moved a whole mountain. We're the best team ever. Their teamwork saved the day. What new mysteries will call to Neo next? Subscribe to find out.